What's going on guys? Welcome back to another Call of Duty mobile video. So we're all wondering where the hell is zombies? Luckily, I have found some online pictures and some leaked information which I'm going to get into on the rest of this video and we're going to tell you all about it. So again, if you are enjoying the content guys, I would massively appreciate it if you can hit that subscribe button, hit a like on this video. If we can get up to 500 likes, I'm thinking of doing another Battle Pass giveaway for you guys. With that said, let's get straight into the video and show you some new leaked pictures of zombies. Let's go. Yeah. Baby, girl, you're so damn fine, no. Wanna know if I can hit it from behind, though. I'm sipping on you like some fun wine, though. When it's over, I press rewind, though. Talking bands, I got it. Benjamin's in my pocket. So what is going on guys? Welcome back to another Call of Duty Mobile video and today this one is going to be on the topic zombies. Now I have actually been sent to me some leaked images of uh, some new zombies information that I've actually found through someone. Now the main thing that we all want to know is, is it going to be co-op? Now if you'll take a look at this picture right here. So this is actually one of the first boss fights called the Butcher and as you can see in the top left corner we've got four players level 11 14 13 and 6 so this image is a late the latest image out for zombies and it actually shows that co-op is going to be confirmed in call of duty mobile zombies so that excites me very much and i hope it excites you guys because i mean I don't know if this is, means that you're going to be able to play solo as well as duo, as well as three players, as well as four. This is the base of the picture I found and it shows four players. So it's pretty definite that the zombies that is going to be most likely coming sort of towards Halloween at the end of this month, end of October, is going to be co-op four players, which is great. Okay, so the next image is of the lobby screen we're going to start with. So I'm going to show you this picture right here. Now, this picture is actually from the alpha stage of Call of Duty Mobile Zombies. So you were actually able to play this back in January, February time. And as you can see, it's not very updated. It's not, there's not that much detail on it. It shows sort of a loadout in the bottom right, and it shows story and operation on the top left. Now, the latest picture that has been released, which is going to be confirmed, is is this one now as you can see it looks a lot more upgraded you've got if you look take a look down to the right hand side right hand bottom side you've got Phil squad um, and take a look as well it seems as though they're going to be adding some difficulty levels in there so as you can see by the normal standard helmet that seems to be the sort of normal level the sort of recruit level uh, the second one is obviously a, a sort of medium difficulty that you'll find in Call of Duty Mobile and then We've also got on the right, it's kind of a devil sort of mask. Now, that obviously means that it's going to be on the highest difficulty. So it's going to be interesting to see how they sort of go about this. Is it going to be a certain difficulty on hard where it's going to be impossible to play and you're going to be grinding on it for hours and hours? Who knows? But all in all, the lobby screen, in my opinion, right there looks absolutely fantastic. And I just really can't wait for Call of Duty Mobile Zombies to come. And now getting on to another leaked picture I found. So we've got here the loadout for zombies. Now this is great. As you can see on the left hand side you can have a primary weapon. As you can see the soldier right there has the DL Q33 sniper. As well as a knife in the secondary position. So we're hoping it's going to be very similar to the sort of Call of Duty's that we've all loved and played before. In the old Black Ops and all of them. So... Also, as you can see on the right hand side, we've got attack, defense and ability perks. So it looks like you're going to be able to mix and match sort of perks to your advantage. Uh, we're going to take a look at the, some more pictures of the actual perks to show you uh, some different colored perks and to show you where to get them and how to get them. So take a look at these. Okay, so as you can see right here, here is the perks menu for Call of Duty Mobile Zombies. So as you can see on the left hand side, it's actually quite interesting. They've actually color coordinated the perks in Zombies this time. And you can probably see there as well, there's a couple of newer perks that we haven't actually seen before. So as you can see on there, the Gecko has a grey sort of perk level it has a green perk level which obviously means the sort of normal level and then we've got purple and gold so we have gray green purple and gold obviously gray being the worst and gold being the best 
Now, interesting as well, because as you can see right there, Gecko, it says, it's actually locked and it says reward for zombies stage 8. So this typically means that you're going to have to grind for those particular perks. And as you can see just below it as well, we've got the golden Gecko, which actually is locked and it's only available for purchase from the store. So it looks like Call of Duty Mobile are going to be uh, making it available. So if you want to kind of do better in Call of Duty Zombies, if you want to sort of play on the how mode that we saw on the lobby screen, you're probably going to have to get some of these golden perks, uh, which they've made it possible to do. Now going on to the next picture, as you can see right there, we have some more perks called Hasten. Now, as you can see, this is a bit of a different one because as you can see on the top left, the Hasten grey level, you actually have to unlock it from an operation on normal difficulty. So they're going to make it so some of these perks you're only going to be able to unlock when you're playing on a certain difficulty. So this is going to be fun to see how it actually pans out. And as you can see just below those as well, we've got the good old double tap, which has been obviously previously shown in many of the different Call of Duty Zombies that we've seen before. So I'm glad that the Call of Duty Mobile Zombies are actually going to be bringing back some of the, the old perks just to make it interesting, to keep that kind of nostalgia that we felt before when playing Zombies. Now scrolling down from that page, obviously you can see there we've got the Juggernaut at grey, green, purple and gold. So as you know, the Juggernaut um, obviously means you can take a certain amount of hits from enemies. I think, it, I think the green one makes it available so you can take three hits. The purple makes it available so you can take five hits. And then obviously if you want to go hard and you want to buy the golden Juggernaut from the store at the bottom just there, you're going to be able to take up to seven hits from the zombies before actually dying or going down. So this is all very, very interesting. And finally, the last picture I want to show you guys is these sets of perks it looks like it's the level three perks as you can see right there we've got the electric cherry which i haven't actually seen before we've also got the fleet foot which obviously gives you a little bit of a speed boost as you can see the gray fleet foot just there you have to have completed stage six reward from zombies just to get that so it does look like zombies are, well the developers are going to make it a proper grind for us which is going to be fun i'm sure a lot of you guys are going to be playing it but back to my previous picture obviously with co-op available it's going to be amazing and that picture just there proves that co-op is going to be in the game so i hope you guys are ex just as excited as i am because it's going to be absolutely incredible now i want to remind you guys that i'm still giving away a free battle pass we live stream on this channel every single day so i Again, I'm going to keep you up with all of the latest information from Call of Duty Mobile Zombies. So I hope you guys can just smash that subscribe button, hit a like on the video, and just enjoy the content because I'll be here all day, every day, trying to get videos out for you guys and keeping you up to date on everything in Call of Duty Mobile. And one last reminder, I am actually still giving away 5,000 free COD points just for subscribing to me and tuning into the live streams. We do giveaways on the live streams every single day and every single week so again make sure you are subscribed make sure you've got your notification bells on and also check out this last video i actually put out which shows you uh, the actual game modes and maps from zombies which are linked just here so thank you guys for watching and i will see you in the next video